Faker's good in a lot of things, but I always felt like assassins are kind of his. I really main bread think and butter. Sivir would have been better here for Anarchy. They they have to do something like flash on Burrow on Rek'Sai to engage, and that is dicey. Uh, we'll see if they can pull it off. They won game two. Who's going to take game three? Time to Ixu find could out. get dove here. Marin. Absolutely. There's the equalizer. Yeah, that's right. Ixu burning down. Bengi just needs one more snowball, man. That is it. Here oh, comes a wave. Ixu. Lyra getting close. Yep. <laughs> a casual snowball <laughs> with the Ari in general. Well, the solo lane's really starting to do work on these towers. and. Oh, Sang it's awesome now. Sang Yoon. Double knock up with that whirlwind though, and Sang Yoon's gonna be able to get away. Ren not doing enough damage. Snowflower taking a lot of damage himself too. Oh boy. Oh wow, Sang Yoon goes back in. That may not have been wise. There's a heal though. Heal from Bang. Bo oh! Sang Yoon able to get it. Play that aggressively, that Bang. Nope. Oh. It's one of those, uh, Marin. Could get dove here. Will get dove here. A lot of damage there coming in with the flash knockup. Marin doing a lot to Ixu. Oh, Marin with a play on to Ixu. Whoa, with the double kill. That is the kind of play that SK Telecom needs to make right now. Really bad dive from Anarchy. That Gnar was nowhere near hitting Mega Gnar for him. They jumped the gun. So. And Bengi and takes Dragon in the meantime. Yep, free Dragon over his entire career in Korea. But that dropped down pretty pretty drastically wow. by the end. I don't know. There's oh, Nara is still available. It. Not a good idea. Oh boy, Marin with a solo kill now. All right. Well, well Mickey doing a lot of damage to Faker here, but meanwhile, Marin able to take the top turret. Oh, Faker nice 1v1 play. by Mickey. Really nice. He caught him. Wow. Until the unicorn <laughs> comes into play. <laughs> Oh, Flash pulverize onto Mickey. Faker coming in for a bit of damage. Can they land something interesting? Chaos Nexus, Chaos Storm rather comes down. Mickey getting low, and the revenge happens. Faker gets the kill. You know, you can't kill Faker 1v1, and he won't. Oh, Fate's Call brings in Lyra. This is Topol as well. Oh, poor Lyra. Lyra. Snowflower coming in to try to save him, but the Absolute Zero going to slow people down. Bang gets a kill there. Song Yoon exhausted. Can they catch up to him? I don't know. No, let me get the flash anyway. Here comes oh, Marin. Marin's going after Mickey meanwhile, but that Chaos Storm's going to do a lot of damage, Faker. Coming down, can they Here we go. close off onto Snowflower? That turret's still there, though. Equalizer goes down, and Bengi can just tank this here. Snowflower pushing people back. Bengi taking a lot of turret damage, but look at that. Wow, Marin's doing so much right now, and Faker comes in for a possible kill. Going after Mickey now. Double kill for Marin in the meantime. Oh, Faker needs to be careful here. Misses the charm. They're going to get the Tier 1 turret, though. And nobody with really much MR, except for the top laner. Problematic, and it gets this very fed rumble. Oh, Hello. Equalizer, and there we go, the Pulverize. He's going to be Meganar. It's a stun on Tamar, and Ixu may have enough health to get out. Snowball coming in. They really want this one. And even Meganar. Oh, Meganar making it out. SK Telecom committing a bit too much for this. Wolf is going to pay for it, it looks like. They're still fighting it, though. Wolf is still alive. I guess he's really tanky now. Mickey getting knocked out. Absolute zero, full channel. That's uh, still not a lot of damage. Well, <laughs> still there. Faker, though, coming in for the cleanup. Marin gets a double kill in the end. I think he manages to pick off Wolf after all said and done. SK Telecom again with such a big lead that they can afford to be a bit silly here. I'm actually shocked that SK Telecom was able to turn that dive around. Me too. Me too. Oh, knock up on a Faker. Faker flashing away. A little bit of damage on Delir on the way out. Sangyu not able to follow. Marin coming back in again. Meanwhile, Bang able to take a turret in mid lane. For the second time in this series. Yep. Oh man, Faker really wants to make picks on the Snowflower. He does, and he's going to get one. Snowflower taking a lot of damage. Faker blows him up. And now he has become Ari, destroyer of supports. How about an inhibitor? Mega I think they'd, they'd love an inhibitor, Doan. I'd love it too. You ready for the desperation engage? Yep, here it comes. They do catch Wolf right before he's pulled out with the Fates call. Ixu trying to get in position because of that Meganar. Wolf thrown back in, though. Knocks people out. Bengi with that absolute zero. Slowing people down. There's an equalizer. Faker comes in. It's cleanup time as Bang enters the fray. And there is nothing Anarchy can do. There is just no engage from Anarchy. They tried their best right there to engage at the right timing around the surrender. Nar bar, and they're just yep. going to surrender. Well, what else can you do? I mean, there is no way that Anarchy was going to win a game like that. But, hey, they took a game off of SK Telecom. I mean, Anarchy, despite losing the match 2-1,
I think that's uh, I think we can pretty much definitively say that's the best we've seen them play yet this season.